For some apparent reason, this game has been flying under the radar for so long, but I've never heard of it. Nobody's talking about it, but it's incredibly addicting. Like I tried it in, in I, I'm hooked. I am absolutely hooked. More people need to play this game. It's like Clash Royale meets Pokemon, and they pulled out something amazingly well polished. I'm gonna show you why. So you start off with a cute girl on the front page. That's always positive. Then you have the single player in the PVP mode. The single player, it's pretty much just a challenge mode for you to kind of learn the game, the, the mechanics, the strategy, and so on. But I'm a beast, so we going straight to the PVP. Know what I mean? <laughs> I'm going first. This is what I do. My strategy is always the same because it's effective, okay? It's effective. We gonna win this, man. We gonna win this. Terra 6 is difficult for me. Oh, these people are strong. Wow, yeah. This guy's definitely strong. Okay, I'm about to kill that guy. <laughs> Boom. Weaken him. All right, yeah, yeah. We making progress. We're making progress. If he hits my dragon, oh no, if he hits the rocket guy, my two of my people are gonna die. Yeah. Yeah, I think he, I, and he's gonna go for that too. Yeah, ah. Uh, I knew it, yeah. Three. Oh my God. Oh God, okay, well. We're just gonna go ahead and, and, and do this then. And hope. Uh, and hope that I can pull this off. Make it at least even. Oh, only hit him once. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. 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 I think I lost. I think I lost. I might need to get rid of my cat and replace. Oh, GG, GG. So as you defeat people in PVP, you're gonna earn some points and then move yourself up different tiers. If you play Clash Royale, then it's similar to that way with the different stages that you have and the different characters that you can unlock, right? This, this is your tiers, right? This is my tier list. The, I'm in tier six. These are the characters and skills that I can get. These are the, the below tiers, so on and so forth. You get the idea. So defeating people in PvP earns you some Q parts, right? So it's gonna come down here, it fills up this bar, once you have enough essence, and you click it, and it's gonna randomly give you something from a different tier, and hopefully you get lucky. Okay, what is the last one? What do we get, what do we get? Come on, why, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Woo! Ah, oh, okay, it's the best one right here. What do we got? Oh! I needed this skill. Yes, I've been looking for this one. What else do I get? Oh, I got ooh, I got a lot of those. Okay. Okay. Yes. Yes. We about to wreck some fools, man. So I've been playing the game for a little bit and I got, you know, a pretty decent amount of capsule mon. And I should probably switch them out, but you know what? My deck is pretty damn good. Oh. GG. Maybe not. Anyways, the high tier monsters over here, it takes longer to upgrade them because you need the pieces for them, but when you can't upgrade them, they are beastly. Same with the skills as well. Like, these things you should not neglect at all. If you use them correctly and you upgrade them right, you can pull off a pretty decent Wombo Combo! If you know what I mean. <laughs> So make sure you upgrade those whenever possible and use the correct one that fits your team the best. Oh, I should also mention that the placement of your Capsulemon on the field is a very, very important to the strategy in the match. Because if you know how your team works correctly and how the combo skills work, then you can pull off really good combos just using all four of your monsters in one turn if you place them in the correct position. Because I placed my bomb guy in the back, I can go through my dragon and it's gonna do me a little ca -ca -ca combo. And I can do extra damage. Ah, and I should just went the other way. Damn. Because I put my bat in the back here, it's really bad when their guy, their monster comes back here because I can just, bam, abuse them. <laughs> abuse them in the back and they can't do anything about it. So whenever you defeat one of their monsters, it takes away the shield from the summoner so you can freely attack them. But who should I go after right now? Let's see if I can go around and hit the guys from the back. Boom, that's exactly what I wanted to do. Oh my God, oh my God, I'm so beastly. Yo, this guy is about to die. 
<laughs> can I pull this? Oh, I can. And I oh, and I still have enough. Okay. You know what? I'm just gonna go in for the kill. Let's go. Ba -ba -ba bam! Boom! 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 Hit him. Oh, and I hit that guy. Boom! Hit him with the skill. Boom! Boom! Blow up all them people. Bam! 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 bam. Oh, I didn't kill anybody though. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I did a lot of damage though. I did so much damage. Yeah, I mean, you just keep him safe at least. Kill one of his people. Keep my weak guy in the back because he's about to kill him. I think he's going to kill my bat next. Or if he's smart, he'll go after my dragon and my little bomb guy because he can get two for one. But I don't think he's going to do that. I don't. I don't think he's going to do it. He's going to go after the bat. Yeah. <gasps> oh. 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 Bravo. Bravo. Let's just finish this off, guys. <laughs> and, yeah, just whatever. <laughs> overkill. It's overkill. Bam. Boom. Blow up. Yeah. Yeah. Can't touch this. Can't touch it. Oh. <laughs> Anyways. Clash Royale is an amazing game, but it can't touch this. This game is too damn good to pass up. Like, you have the awesome graphics, you have these cute little Pokemon-like monsters who you can use to defeat your opponents in so many different ways, and a kind of like bocce ball kind of gameplay. Something something similar to that, but better. This game is incredibly addictive. I just ca I cannot stop playing it. It's like, once you get that winning streak to happen, it's like the Energizer Bunny. You just keep going and going and going. It doesn't stop. It's just, it. I don't know what it is. I, I love it. I love this game so much. I don't say that about a lot of games, but this game, it does something to me and I like it. I like it so much. <laughs> anyways, anyways, we'll leave a link down in the description below for you to check out and try out for yourself because I think you'll love it. Trust me. Let us know what you think in the comments down below. And until next time, I'm Dennis and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.